Hello, my name is Scott for SB Gaming. Welcome back to Transport Fever. We're here in the fifth mission for the America campaign, and we are getting close to getting the money for this. Nine, we're up to nine million dollars. We're gonna make it in about three months ish, and it is March of 1934. We have 22.8 million dollars in the bank, and uh, yeah, so. Things are going quite well for us. And actually, I wouldn't mind getting up to about 30 million because something's going to happen where we're going to need a whole lot of money. But yeah, this should be fine. This should be good for now. And how are we doing over here? We are just about getting the 10 million dollars and we have that stone. That ship is returning and that ship is coming over here. And, uh,. Actually, what we can do is we no longer need Las Vegas transfer on the run. We're going to switch that to load if available. And, oh, that's a little bit annoying. Huh. Yeah, when you remove it from the list, some of the trucks, if they were hauling to it, will actually lose the cargo. Just throw it out. Don't need it. And uh, yeah, about that. Anyway, how much have we got here? Someone wanting to go to LA. Oh boy. To make matters worse, the postal authority has also discovered the heavy sacks full of our junk mail. They have imposed a heavy fine upon us that we'll need to pay off first of all. As we're not currently liquid enough to pay the entire penalty in one go, we've been granted a grace period on part of it. How nice of them. The bandits. Kleptomaniacs. Money bags. Three quarters of our assets have already been confiscated as a down payment. The rest of this record fine is due when we are liquid enough to pay. All right, so I got some like 16 million. Really? I got 16 million taken from me and I have a fine of 16. Is that 16 million? Yeah, 16 million one five zero. Is this amount equal to no, that can't be right. We had about 22 million, right? Anyway, we have 16. Oh no, no. I think if the math is right, you need to make 30, 30 something million. And then they take thir three quarters of it. And then, or no. Okay, so it's a th it's about a $30 million fine. And we got 16 million deducted. All right, so generate enough cash to pay off the rest of the fine. Yep, so that's why we've set up things as we have. Making tons of cash from lots of things. It was a success. The former airmail pilot Charles Lindbergh has crossed the Atlantic nonstop. What a triumph. And the development of new aircraft models is rapidly advancing. This progress is opening up interesting areas of business for us. The Douglas Aircraft Company is making its latest model, the DC-3, available to us at a preferential price. Soon, transporting passengers by airplane will be more lucrative than a few bags of mail ever was. All right. All right, so I had just noticed that uh, these planes are actually flying. Uh, I hate that. I really hate that. I don't like the fact that this is set to three minutes maximum waiting time. And that's happen. You have to. I, know. I wish it was a game option in the settings here, but nope. It's on the specific line. Now, how are we doing over here? All right, we have this ship that's coming back with 63 fuel. Do I have? Where is my truck that is? That's hauling fuel. I think I only have one of those. Uh, vehicles. Yep, I only have one on that. So I'm going to ramp. Going to want to add more. 
Especially since we have 20. Let's buy some vehicles. Ford Model 77s, and we are... What's this one? RF Phoenix Freight. And there we go. And now we are going to want to... Oh, nice. So, we are going to want to buy some Douglas DC-3s. These have eight capacity. And yet, when it had a capacity of one, it was designed to carry mail cargo. So, capacity is limited. Unfortunately, the planes that you still have around, they keep their capacity of one. So I'm going to have this return to depot. That one's fine. That I'm going to have return to depot. And we are going to start buying some DC-3s because apparently we have passengers here. All right, so buy aircraft. Uh, we're gonna have a DC-3, another one, and another one. You, we are going to set to Yep. LA. You, we are going to set to SB. And this one, we are going to set to SD. And now, I think, yep, we just got this one. So we are going to upgrade this. It's a good idea to have multiple terminals. And, oh, that's right. If there were passengers here and we upgraded it, they are gone. You lose all the passengers. Now, let's come over here. We have to haul 300 passengers, nothing waiting. All right, Air Phoenix to LA. We are going to buy an aircraft, Douglas DC-3. And this is going to be the last task of the game. Uh, what's this guy waiting for? Phoenix to LA. Phoenix to LA. And then have San Diego. Bye. Go to uh, yeah, San Diego. Now, what I'm going to also want to do is connect up Las Vegas with whichever place it is. <laughs> Las Vegas with Santa Barbara. I'm going to buy a plane and we are just going to New line. There. Over to there. And we're going to call this Air Las Vegas to SB. And we are going to buy a plane from here. The money is slipping through our fingers, people. We'll soon be bankrupt. But if we're prepared to grovel on our hands and knees, sure. the financiers will grant us a bridge loan. Wow. <laughs> Normally I get that early in the uh, mission, but uh, I guess I haven't really been spending my money. And we want to new line from here over to... We'll go to Phoenix. And this is going to be Air Phoenix to Las Vegas. Nice. And all right, we have apparently two planes on that run. That's fine. And then Las Vegas, we are going to have 
No, I don't want to buy an aircraft. Douglas DC-3. We're going to go new line and we're going to go to uh, oh no, not here. Bother. I wanted to LA. Anyway, we're just going to, or not LA, Las Vegas. We're going to buy the aircraft here. Set line. And we just have, yeah, new line here over to San Diego. This is going to be here, Las Vegas to San Diego, or San Diego. Works for me. And I'm just going to delete that line. Any others? All right, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So what I'm going to want to do, okay, San Diego, we have Santa Barbara, Las Vegas to Phoenix, we have Las Vegas to San Bernard, or not San Bernardino, San Barbara, or Santa Barbara, Las Vegas to San Diego. Okay, we got those. We got Phoenix to LA, Santa Barbara, and actually Phoenix goes to four. We have LA, Air Phoenix to LA. We have Las, no, not Las Vegas. Phoenix to, am I missing something here or not? Do I have Las Vegas to LA? No, I don't. All right, about that. We will set it up over here because reasons. Uh, yep. Buy aircraft, Douglas DC-3. Set line, new line from here over to here. Las Vegas. Los Angeles, or rather LA to Vegas. All right, so they are still flying. Take a look at our lines and we have a couple of vehicles in the depots. Let's, yeah, I'm just gonna sell it. Grow depots, we'll sell this as well. Uh, they're incoming, fine. Sell that and sell that. And this one is touching down. We have nine years or so to get this done. It shouldn't be a problem. I don't really need to do not much more spending, so... This fine should be easy to pay off, especially with the lines that we've set up. Phoenix to LA. two planes on it so where are my planes exactly yep 
you are over at LA and you are over um Okay, you are flying through the ground. <laughs> All right, bet that. And we have the Douglas DC-3, the Hiawatha, Streamline Coach, New Mexico, and the Zurich. So you were carrying four passengers, so yeah. All right. What I'm going to do is come back over here to Vegas. Oh, there's no one waiting. Okay, apparently not Vegas then. Was it Phoenix? Phoenix to LA. Okay, never mind. Let's buy another plane. Air Phoenix to Las Vegas. No, wrong one. By aircraft, we're going to buy two DC-3s and we are going to set this to Phoenix to LA. Just get everything off the screen. No, you... Phoenix, yes. Really? You were going to actually fly over to... L.A. That is insanity there. Waste my time flying over to L.A. Because when we have passengers over here. Yeah, that is not happening. We're going to buy another Douglas DC-3. We're going to set it to Air Phoenix. To LA. You. Good. And we have our planes flying. Yeah, we're down to 6.8 million, whether or not my planes are going to make money right now we're losing money with the planes but we do need to transport people so it's all part of the mission oh what's happening here oh nice we got a ton of food wow so what i'm going to do is los angeles to santa barbara buy another ship and we had the zurich which is a passenger ship all right so Grab a Klondike, and you are going to be hauling to Santa Barbara, or rather to LA. LA to Santa Barbara. And you, LA to Santa Barbara, so you are... Yeah, about that. What do we got down here? We got a whole lot of stuff. LA to send the... Unfortunately, the problem with these small cargoes here. 15 to San Diego, the 3, the 2, the... Is that we need an individual ship for each of these. So what if we go with something smaller like the front... No, not the front neck. Passenger, really? So this is the okay. Never mind. Let's buy another one, and we want this to go to San Diego. We have only one option available for most cargoes, and we have 62 fuel here or crude. You are returning, and you have no. Really? Okay, about that. 101. I guess that fuel showed up after you left. 
let's throw some more vehicles on the uh, the exchange San Diego exchange and we're gonna buy a couple more for the freight line San Diego freight They're a whole bunch of army ants. That's what they are. Nice. How are we doing down here? And you are hauling 100 food. You're bringing nine machines. Now, I think this is definitely very profitable. Although I wanna check ship freight. Nah, not really profitable. <laughs> the San Diego fuel, though. It's pretty decent. Uh, the stone one is doing all right. Although, yeah, the, these are... Mm. They're slow to make money. Now, what do we got here? You know what? Las Vegas slag oh wow all those small individual ones what I'm going to do is buy road vehicles we're gonna throw some model 77s and we are going to connect it to the Las Vegas slag line and I just want to make sure are they going to go the right direction yes they are nice and we're going to buy a couple more and we are going to send these to the Los Angeles Iron. And yeah, there's construction materials being brought up here, which is nice. Slag being brought down, construction materials being brought back. And... Oh, wait a minute. Nope. Load if available. There we go. And we have a class PRR GG1. We're up to 11 million. How are we doing over here? A little bit short of coal. Oh, there we go. And how are you? You are bringing coal, nice. What I'd like to do, we're gonna buy some Ford Model 77s and send it to Los Angeles Coal. So we have 20 here. Good, 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 good. And just to make sure, yep, load if available. Over here, doing pretty good. And now we have a whole lot of food. LA to Santa Barbara, you are LA to Santa Barbara. Wait a minute. Whoa, 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 what that? Really? All right, let's buy. There's a reason my ships are not making money. They're going empty. Uh, LA to Santa Barbara, yeah. Please tell me you are going to the Santa Barbara transfer. Yes, you are. Yeah, I definitely want to get this cleared out because that's a ton of food going out to sea. We have 66 passengers of 300 transported. We have seven years or so to get this done. We're going to buy another Klondike. Set line to Santa Barbara. 
and that's hauling 100. Nice. And that one's coming from San Diego. That one's coming from Santa Barbara. Now here's the question. Did I upgrade this? No, I didn't. Don't bother. Yeah, I should have. More ships can come in if it's upgraded. Otherwise, they'll have to queue to wait like these two ships. Anyway, that's fine there. And we have a ton of food here heading up that direction. This is very nice to see because all those trucks are going up to the iron mine. They'll be dr dragging all that stuff up there, dragging all of it back here, making money going both ways. That's what you want. And this is what's great about trucks, especially the ones that can handle everything. You don't have to worry about them not having a load. Unlike trains, which can only haul certain things, such as the state cars only being able to haul planks, logs, steel, construction material. And we have a ship coming in here with 28 fuel and there's 106 waiting. Nice. Now these ships are doing pretty decently. How is their finances? 1.04 million, 695. Yeah, it seems like with ships every second year you have a good payout and then they have a, a low year. But with two ships, it looks like it's very consistent, although we did have a good year here, possibly because one dropped off at the start of the year and a couple others dropped off and uh, yeah. But yeah, if you can get them hauling in both directions, that is just all the better. And what is happening over here? You have more. Yeah, we might as well buy some more buses. I'm going to put this on which route? RT1. And I just want to make sure that they are going to be going. Nope. There we go. And we got quite a few passengers. We're gonna put two on the San Diego run. He will pick up to LA. By aircraft, two DC-3s. And the Air Phoenix to San Diego. We have 105 transported in the DC-3. Things are coming along quite nicely. It's 1937. How far are we through medals? Yeah. Finish the mission before 1943. Own at least 20 planes at the end of the mission. So yeah. <laughs> Buying the planes allows us to get that medal. Yeah, Phoenix LA. Wow. One, two, three, four, five, six. 9, 10, 11, 12. 16 planes. Although these two probably also count, so that is something. I want to get rid of these two though, just because. Uh, Santa Barbara Annex, these ones. Yep, yeah, these are the old ones. Let's sell those off. you yeah I... and you are picking up yep you I want you to a Phoenix Airport don't fly over to San Diego and there's passengers here and now how are we doing over here we have Five that want to go to Phoenix. You are Santa Barbara. You are Vegas, San Diego, and you are Please tell me why someone a lane is a route is not using this one here. 
you. Oh, did I? Yes, I did. Load if available. Yep, I no longer need the load if available, so we're just going to... Or load, full load. I just want these things to be flying rather than being grounded. There we go. We have 15.9 million of the 16.15 to pay. We have 121 being flown in the DC-3s. That will happen eventually, and it will probably happen very quickly, actually. Good gracious, we're spending money like there's no tomorrow. Just this once, our financial backers are willing to turn a blind eye and help us out once again. But sure. this is definitely the last time. <laughs> Thanks. Well, we got, we got that task completed, so all we have to do right now is to transport people in the DC-3. And so let's go over to You're still flying through hills. All right, so you You made 16.5. We're going to send you back to depot. And now you're carrying 4 Santa Barbara, how many want to fly? All right, well, we are going to buy by aircraft a DC-3. We're going to set this to the San Las Vegas. And then we are going to buy another DC-3. And this one's going to go to the SD to Santa Barbara. Santa Barbara Airport and Santa Barbara Airport. Good. All right. Let's hop over to the Las Vegas Airport. Anyone waiting here for a ride? Nope. Okay. Back to Phoenix. And we got three, four, and five. That's fine. We'll probably have some planes coming in. Maybe. Never mind. How many here? Three and five. Five and six. And you. You're coming in. Phoenix, LA. And you are a LA to Las Vegas. All right, well, I'm going to buy. You are, okay, good. You're coming in for landing. I can sell you off. I'm going to want to buy two. And there we go, high flyer. Own at least 20 planes at the end of the mission. Well, we're not at the end of the mission yet, and I could probably sell them off if I wanted to, but uh, no. <laughs> we are going to Uh, Phoenix to LA. Why are they only using two terminals? Okay, actually, no, I only have two lines. That's fine. All right. And then Phoenix to LA. Los Angeles and you better not be going to good speed things up and you are a Phoenix to LA nice kind of want to pay attention to this one just because I want to sell it off it's not worth me keeping around. Anyway, how is our planes doing? Well, we're barely making a profit on the Phoenix to LA. Every other plane is losing money. 
But it doesn't matter. All we have to do is fly some DC-3s. As long as we have passengers. And now... Let's send to Depot. And I'm going to go first person. Heading to the Phoenix Airport. Wow, that uh, plane doesn't much care for the hills. <laughs> All right about that. And, whoa. Uh, pull up, pull up. Never mind. Coming in for landing. We are here over at Phoenix Airport. The only problem with the planes I have is the fact that they touch down right about here. Right in the middle of the... Actually. Okay, they're supposed to touch down here. But yeah, they touch down about here, which doesn't give them much, much space to stop and slow down, but uh, it's much better than a game like uh, City Skylines. <laughs> and we have 203 fuel, nice! Rather, 203 crude. You're not bringing any fuel back. Why? You're bringing back 69, so yeah, you guys are... Are you guys making me money? Finances, oh yeah, indeed. 1.41 million on 275k in, uh, yeah. Now, how are we doing down here? We got 112. Going to Santa Barbara to LA. You are one of those. You're not carrying back anything, really. Okay. You're bringing up fuel. Nice. Although for some reason fuel is getting shifted over to the... Yeah, that's the problem with those... Uh... The ships are massive capacities and if they're only bringing like 10 units or something... It's a little bit disappointing. Anyway, we have 215 of 300. It is April 18th, April, April 18th, 1938. And uh, yeah, we should get this done with plenty of times to spare. Oh, let's jump in first person. And you are heading to Las Vegas. Oh dear. Pull up. <laughs> no! Okay. Alright, so I am hoping that we can get this done pretty quickly. I'm looking at the time, it's about 40 minutes now, and uh, what are you complaining about? Construction materials plant. You're saying to ship more items? What are you telling me to ship? Oh wow. Ship more stuff. Four or five. Now, are you all going to go Las Vegas construction materials. 
Please tell me you are not going to go that way. Of course you are. And you as well. Go up there and grab me some construction materials. 263 of 300. Yeah, this is a relatively easy mission to do. We have 11,000 in the bank. <laughs> How are we doing financially wise though? If we take a look at our income, 13 million, 13 million, 15.6 million, and 12.3 million up until this point this year with a month and a half to go. Road. <laughs> Ten million dollars from road vehicles on a running cost of two point four three million. Oh yes, indeed, road vehicles are very well underestimated. Now we made three million off of water. We don't have any trains. That's the thing. 8.42 million. Yeah, about that. We have a $37 million loan. <laughs> yeah, about that. Not that we can pay it off or anything. And you have... Uh, what are you... What did you just do? Why? Why? Why are you leaving without any freaking food? You're going back to LA. Wow. Come on, yeah, there you go. Is that what my ships are doing? You're coming back with LA to Santa Barbara. <sighs> you could at least bring some of this back. But no, you're too good to bring stuff back. How are we doing over here? We just have some fuel. Of course, yeah, that's all we have over here. And we got 53 fuel. And you're hauling 150 crude. Nice. We have 164 there. Uh, no, no. Oh, wow. Seriously. You left without bringing any crude. Never mind. Just go back. Ugh. The debts have been settled and the people are going aviation mad. Especially with our attractive offers. We are the lords of the skies. And we have a gold medal. Anyway, that is going to be it for this episode of Transport Fever. We got all five medals. We got Aviation Pioneer. Finish it before 1943. No problem. 1939. As I figured. Own at least 20 planes at the end of the mission. Yep. Own all landing permissions, yep, and yep, and yep. This one's pretty easy to get. I don't think it's possible to not, just because it pops up for me before I even really start the Los Angeles chain of production. Groundskeeper is easy to do. You just have to get for airports and upgrade their terminals. Nailed cartel, you eventually get it anyway, and own at least 20 planes, not a problem. Anyway, at this point in time, I'd like to say thank you for joining me for this episode of Transport Fever. Thank you for watching. My name is Scott for SB Gaming, and as always, have a good day.